the test. Her phone rings. He says, I'm here. She says, meet me in the rear. Now she's walking down the stairs and getting this feeling of fear. Wondering what would happen if she's caught in the action. It's too late right now. No excuses right now. She's going to lose it right now. She is new to this feeling and a point of no return. Eager to earn, she opens the door. A hug should receive. It feels so firm. He stares in her eyes. A kiss he earns. So they turn and walk the way up the stairs. An awkward moment of silence and thoughts start to appear in her mind. Wondering about the time. Not the time when her mother comes back, but the time that is now where she can never take back. They walk in the room on the couch they sat. So they talk and conversate a bit. But she can tell in his eyes that he has his itch. Not thinking what his mom, but thinking what his dick. He leans in for a kiss and he's reaching down her pants. This is not how she pictured it. Even though it made her heart lifted, she tells him to quit it. So she switches up the mood and walks into the kitchen asking, Are you hungry and do you want some food? He says, I'm on a diet and all I want to eat is you. She paused and lost her train of thought. Wetness between her thighs and he rises from the couch and walks into the kitchen. Walking as if he was on a mission. Backs her up into a corner puts her in a position where she can't escape but it's too late. She wants him to stop but this feeling is too great. He whispers in her ears and says, I'm going to make your legs shake. Put her in a trance. When he gave her this glance, next thing she knew, he was pulling her pants off. The only thing standing between them was a piece of cloth. But last time she checked, her ocean was a Red Sea. She feels if she told him, he might think she's using it as a plea to get out of a sexual need that they both desire. A thought transpired in her mind saying, this can happen another time. And she says, stop. I'm not ready. I'm on my last day. I'm still heavy. His missile now turned into a spaghetti. He answers back, what you mean you're not ready? Three months we going steady. I give you the whole world, the whole confetti. She says, yes, I'm not ready. If you love me, you'll hold your confetti until I'm ready. But right now, I'm not ready. So can you respect my wishes? If you can't, there are plenty of fishes in the sea that wouldn't mind the way to clean my dishes. Sorry I wasted your visit. My doors are shut. If you leave now, your only motive was to fuck. So his mouth, he stood shut. His pants, he picked up. His shoes, he laced up. His mood, he switched up. The knob, he loosed up. The door, he closed shut. His M.O. was to fuck. The lie she made up. Her time of the month was done. It was just a test she made up to question his love. Joseph DeShields.